appropriate from truth. 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 You believe it to achieve it, or you never will. Spoke some things into the universe, and they appear. What up, everybody? Welcome to level four of our ball on a string development series. We're going to continue to upgrade our skills by working more on our ball control and adding some footwork to it. Okay, so I encourage you guys to go back to our previous lessons from level one, two, and three to continue to kind of just upgrade everything we're doing, kind of strengthen everything we're doing. And remember, we always want to be balanced being in stance, okay? Let's get started. I'm excited to work with you guys. Let's get to it. All right, here we're working on one hand pounds. We're gonna go between the legs all the way through. We're gonna work on our grip, okay? Spreading our fingers and having it go between our legs even more under control. Now remember our stance, we're low in the stance and we're gonna get it right between our legs, all right? We're gonna get 20 reps each way. All right, ready? One. Let's bring it to the left now. You see how I'm carrying that ball? I'm not letting that, my hand come under the ball. I'm, it's always on the side. So what I'm doing here is I'm letting the ball bounce through and bringing it over, okay? So 20 on the right side, now we go to the left. See how I'm still staying in my stance? If you have to look down, that's fine. Just to get more comfortable, it's okay to look down. As you get more comfortable, you wanna challenge yourself by looking forward, all right? Going left hand. Ah, challenge yourself. Strengthen that left hand, working on all one hand. Ah. 18, 19, 20. There we go. Now after we bring it forward, we're gonna bring it backwards now, all right? Right behind, all right? Drop it right in front of us, okay? That ball's coming right in front of us. All right, so right hand. Two, three, four. See how I'm sitting in my standstill, I'm not coming up. Staying strong with my legs, whipping it around. It's gonna work on your grip, work on your arm strength, your hand strength. 20, all right, 20 left now. Whip it through, whip it through, ready? Go. Ah. Whip it around, use that speed to get it around. It's good for your core strength too. Tighten those abs. Work on strengthening that core. 20. Go work with the one hand series, let's move on. Now that we've warmed up our hands and our arms, our grip, our senses from the one hand pounds, the one hand series going between the legs, now we're gonna go ball manipulation drill over the cone. You're gonna have a water bottle at home. What we're simply doing is allowing the ball to float over. My hand's staying on top of the ball. We're just going pounds over, okay? Allowing the ball to just float and we're pounding, okay? This is gonna help you work in between tight spaces when you're on the court, trying to get to one place to another, all right? So what we're gonna do is gonna stay stationary right now. We're gonna start off with stationary pounds over pounds. Then we're gonna go to crossover, double crossover. Then we'll go between the legs and then behind the back. We're gonna go all the way through, through the full combo. All right? We're gonna go 20 seconds each spot. All right, let's get started. Remember, eyes up, stay in a low stance. Under control. All right, see how I'm swaying? You don't want to be swaying out of control, you want it to be smooth. Pound it right over. Eyes up, staying in the low stance. After that 20 seconds is up, let's go left. Ready, go. Remember that guard arm is up. We don't want to rest that hand on the knee. Staying in a low stance. Manipulate that ball over. It's going to really tighten the handle right here. Controlling that ball with ease. Good work. Keep going, keep going. Keep pushing yourself. 
Good work. Good job. Now we're gonna go crossovers, okay? Once we finish crossovers going right and left, we're gonna bring it to double crossovers going right and left. All right? Whew, ready? Go. Two, three, cross. One, two, three, cross. Two, three, cross. Stay under control. Handling that ball. One, two, three, cross. Cross. Remember, 20 seconds. Push yourself, push yourself. Push yourself. Good work, good work. Good work, keep going, keep going. Push yourself. Good work. Now we're gonna go double cross, okay? Right hand double cross, then we'll go left hand double cross, okay? Ready? Go. Three, double cross. One, two, three, double cross. Three, double cross. Three, double cross. Pound over, double cross. Pound over, double cross. If that ball's bouncing away, that's okay. Get back into it. Keep pushing yourself. One, two, three, double cross. One, two, three, double cross. Now let's go left. Same thing. Push yourselves, guys. Push yourself. We just getting started. Ready? Double cross. Push yourself. Push yourself. Really tighten up the handle. Big hands, staying in that stance, dropping those hips, working from the inner step, that inner step. Push, push. Good work, good work, good work. Now we're going between the legs, all right? Same with the over pounds, between the legs, then we're going double between the legs, right and left. All right, let's go. Three between one, two, three between. Push that through. Push that ball through. Two, three between. Push that ball. Push that ball. One, two, three between. One, two, three between. Ah. Push. Good job, good job. Now we're going doubles. We're going doubles now. Starting off with the right. One, two, three, one, two. One, two, three, one, two. Two, three. One, two, three, two. Stay low. See how I'm staying in my stance? I'm not coming up. I'm not compromising my stance. Always low. Work those legs, you guys, work those legs. That burn you're feeling, that's natural. Your muscles are working, you're gonna get stronger. Believe me, you do this every day, by next week, you'll be feeling so much stronger. Keep pushing. Let's bring it to the left now. Ready? Do this every day, you get stronger. Three. Strengthen those legs, strengthen the body. Push. Whip it around, whip it around, quick. Ah. 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 Good work, good work. Now we've done the crossover, we've done between the legs, including the doubles. Now we're gonna go behind the back, then we'll go behind the back doubles, and when we're done with that, we're gonna put them all together. All right, we're gonna go with single, 
Then we'll go with doubles, all right? Let's finish strong, keep going, all right? Let's go. One, two, behind. One, two, three, behind. One, two, three, behind. Two. If you gotta look at the ball, that's okay. But as much as you can for those more advanced players, try to guess where that ball is at. Feel that ball, know where you're gonna bring it. Know where you're gonna bring it. Challenge yourself here. Challenge yourself. Sit in that seat, sit in that seat. Good work, keep pushing, keep pushing. Good work, good work. Right into doubles now, right hand, right into doubles. Let's go. One, two, three, double behind. Two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Whip it. Whip it back there. Two, three. One, two, three. Let's go. Finish strong. Two, three. Good work. That's the right hand. Let's move on to the left, all right? Ready? One, two, three. Ah, two, three. Let that ball float. Let that ball float. Big hands. Big hands, you guys, big hands. One, two, three, double behind. One, two, three, double behind. Double behind. Almost there, almost there, push. Be strong, pound that ball, pound that ball. Ah. One, two, three. Good work, good work, good work. All right, now we're gonna put it all together now. You guys know how we do it. You've been with me long enough to know what's next, all right? I know many of you guys may be tired right now, so I want you to remember to test yourself mentally, push yourself to the end, and let's finish strong, all right? Let's remember the reps and keep going, all right? Keep going, this way you're gonna get better. All right, now we're gonna put it together with one, two, three, cross between behind, one, two, three, cross between behind, all right? We're done with that with 20 seconds. We're gonna go doubles. All right, so one, two, three. Double cross, double between, double behind. Right hand. We do that for 20 seconds, then we'll go left hand. One, two, three, double cross, double between, double behind. All right, that's gonna finish it off right there. Let's go, keep pushing, okay? Let's go, I'm with you guys, I'm with you guys. Ready, go, one, two, one, two, three, quick. Test yourself, go quick. One, two, three, boom, boom, boom. One, two, three, boom, boom, boom. One, two, three, boom, boom, boom. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Push. Good job, good job. Let's go right into the doubles now, all right? Right into the doubles. Now, I'm feeling a little bit tired right now, and I'm sure you guys are too. Push it, all right? Push it. This is where we can get better, work through fatigue, stay mentally sharp, stay strong. Okay, that's how we're gonna get better. Let's go. Right hand. One, two, three, double cross, double between, double behind. One, two, three, double cross, double between, double behind. You guys are fumbling it, that's okay. Make sure you get right back to it. Get back to it. Test yourself every day with this. I guarantee you'll feel it. One, two, 
One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Push. Push. Test that hand speed. Test your strength right here. Good work. Let's go left hand now. Left hand. Ready? Let's go. Test it, come on, test it out. See what you got here. While you're tired, see what you can get out of this. Ah. 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 One, two, three. Ah. Ah. One, two, three. Ah. 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 Keep it tight, keep it tight. Tight, finish strong. Almost there. Almost there. Double cross, double between, double behind. Go work, go work, go work. Way to push. You guys push me. Keep going. See you on the next one. Now that we've worked on our ball control portion of level four, we're gonna bring in the footwork, okay? We're gonna be breaking down footwork. We always wanna be in a stance. Footwork is key in the game of basketball. It'll be super easy for you to score once you understand footwork is important, all right? So we're staying in our stance again, how we're gonna break it down before we start dribbling, before anything. We already got the ball control going, now let's get our footwork following, all right? So I'm on the same line, you see on my feet, my toes are on the same line, straight, I'm in my stance. Now all I want you guys to do is stagger that stance, all right? Then come back to the same line, stagger it again, you're switching off, all right? This is gonna prepare you this is the prep for us going between the legs, adding the footwork, okay? We're gonna be doing this for 20 seconds. And once you get more comfortable, start turning your toes in that direction. Not all the way like this, we wanna get it staggered a bit. Boom, boom, all right? So once you get more comfortable, get quicker. You see how my feet are moving out to that direction that they're supposed to be going to? See how they're on the same line, synchronize? That's our footwork, all right? 20 seconds of that, then we go right into between the legs, all right? Now we add the dribble, okay? You can go pound between the legs, see how I moved it? Every time that ball is in the left hand, that left knee will come up. Then we come back. Right hand, right knee is coming up. So our feet are following the ball, okay? Our feet are following the ball. So we're adding our footwork here. Now some of you, you can have the pound and go. Others can just go straight. Ah, go straight, right into it, all right? See the footwork there? I'm constantly switching, okay? So let's just work off the pound right now. We'll just work off the pound, and as we get more comfortable, we'll go right into it, okay? We're gonna go 30 seconds straight between the legs. Okay? Ready? Go. See how my feet are coming back? That back leg is pushing off. As you get more comfortable, speed it up. Push yourself. Good job. Good work, good work. Now we're gonna be breaking down the hesitation. It's a slight pause after our pound, okay? Now the key here is same thing as the between the legs. Our feet are gonna be following the ball, okay? So we're just gonna be working on the right hand side first, then we'll switch it off to the left. All right, we'll go 20 seconds right, 20 seconds left. Simple, all right? Take your time, you don't have to go full speed here. The key is to work on your footwork and the pause, letting that ball float. We don't wanna bring our hand into the ball. We wanna bring it sort of to the side. Let it float up. You're gonna let that energy from the ball come up, keeping it on the side, and then panning it back down. So the hesitation is a move where we're selling our jump shot. Okay, we wanna be able to right there and then go, okay? In full speed, this is what it will look like. 
and then going, okay? So we're working on that. But now we have to do it stationary, break it down first, so we can utilize it in the game in the later levels. All right? So here's what we're gonna do. Remember, our foot follows the ball, all right? Pound, pick up. Pound, pound. All right, take your time with this one. Make sure your feet are on the same line. Head is going up. As you get more comfortable, find a little quicker rhythm. See how my feet are always moving? Hands are big. Work those legs. All right, let's go left now. Okay, you see how my head is coming up at the same time with the ball? That's to sell your shot. Your shot is going up, you're not going, the defender's up, we go by him. So the key is not to get this hand under the ball. You'll get called for a carry by the ref. So you wanna keep it on the side as much as possible, then go. All right, left hand, left hand. Ready? See how my foot is following the ball? Left hand, left foot. Stay bouncy. Stay light on your feet. Work on the stick, work on the tippy toes. Work on the balls of your feet. See how my hands coming in? See how my hands coming in? Oh, there you go, he's out. Good work.